If only it didn't have the drool on it. Who is this man? If you know, comment down below. Who is this man? <laughs> What is that? <laughs> it looks like a um, like a mongoose unicorn. Oh no, I am so guilty of this. Ah, ban the scrunchie. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Erica with Tiny Acorn. Usually when I go into a thrift store, I don't really have a plan in mind. I kind of just go towards whatever catches my eye but I thought it would be fun to make a Pinterest mood board and thrift my Pinterest board. I'm actually going thrifting with my friend Kristen and she decided to do the same thing. So if that sounds fun to you guys, make sure to stick around, ring the bell to subscribe. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. All right guys, so I'm here in the car with Kristen. Hey. <laughs> so we're about to share what we are going to be going thrifting for. Okay, so for my Pinterest, looking for green and orange is the colors that I'm looking for. Oh, I'm looking for a lot of green too. You are? Yes. Green. So I have a bunch of different greens, like lime green, pea green, emerald green. Like, I don't know. I'm just drawn to that right now. And then also oranges. I'm like very into orange lately. And so any sort of bright orangey color. Um, and then moving on. I think it would be really cool to find some sets, oh, like yeah. pants and coat sets or pants and tops. I know sets are kind of hard to find though, so. And then I also wanted to thrift some plaid pants. Same, actually. Really? Yeah, yeah you'll see. <laughs> yeah, plaid pants. I mean, they're kind of in right now, but yeah, some like retro-y plaid pants would be so awesome. And I love like the gingham pattern, but bigger scale. So what is that? Buffalo plaid? Is I that think like so. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> Mailman cameo. Okay. And then, yeah, so I have some plaids. Also sweaters that are special. So either like bobbles on them, balloon sleeves, um, sweaters that have designs like knit into the sweater. So like cool one with the sun. Oh, here. I love that. Um, or the one with like the house here. So cute. Yeah. Um, and then also, oh my gosh, I want to, I really want to thrift a really cute vintage sweater vest, but I want it to be cropped oh. like this blue one because it's just so cute. We want to wear the, um, vintage blouses underneath it like that. And then you know that dress that I've been talking about a lot? An A-line, like, pinafore style Yeah, like 60s. Like, I want to wear, like, a collared or, like, a pussy bow blouse underneath them. Yeah, I so, like that. So, something like that would be really cute. And then also, like, a liner jacket. That's not that shiny material. It's just, oh, like... Oh, softer. Yeah. Yeah. Of course, quilted coats, like... I put that on mine too. <laughs> I mean, he's not trying to I totally find... got that from you, but yeah, yeah but they're so cute. I mean, they're everywhere right now. Everyone's mm -hmm. making quilted coats. They're amazing. I don't think they're going out of style anytime soon. Um, if anything, they're getting ramped, amped up. Yeah. I agree. Yeah, totally. <laughs> I am always just kind of a fan of those long like trench, not trench coats. I don't know what to call them. Are they car coats? Like what is this called? Oh, I don't know. It's a, it's a long coat, like a long wool coat, but I'd love to find something that's in a plaid pattern. Ooh, that's cool. kind of oversized. I think that is such a cute look. And then, you know how I always have to have some sort of like embroidery type of thing. I don't know. I mean, same. Yeah. Chain stitch embroidery. I feel like anything like that. I know I could just do it myself. It just takes so much time. It's true. It'd be better to find it like already done for me. Just like a cool vintage thing. Okay. So to recap, I'm doing like orange and green sets, um, plaid pants, cool sweaters with like designs on them and sweater vests, the A-line pinafore type of dress, any sort of like liner jacket or quilted jacket, or a long jacket and then embroidery. Perfect. That's a lot. I 
mine i got really carried away too so no worries <laughs> it'll, it'll give us more like room for error like we're yeah. definitely gonna find something that's on our board since we have yeah. so many categories there's some options for yeah, us. yeah totally okay. okay so i also created a thrifting goals pinterest board some of the things i have on there are like utility jumpsuits um like i have a lot of jumpsuits but i don't have any like like denim ones like you mm. know a lot of mine are very feminine i like kind of want to look like a mechanic at this point you know yes. just like really hardcore ones i love it yeah also some like wide leg jeans or mom jeans mm -hmm. might be kind of hard to shop for jeans because if we can't try them on but if they're really good <gasps> oh i'll my buy gosh. them anyway what? you reminded me okay a thrift tack okay so oh. for right now with covid yeah you can't try stuff on at least not pants bring a measuring tape with you so we can measure oh. our waist and our hips and then measure the pants and then make sure that they're going to fit us. Oh, that's amazing. That's so smart. I don't know yes. why I never thought to do that. That's so good. I know. Okay. okay. So now awesome. You might I can shop for to... jeans. Mm -hmm. Yay. All my snacks. Look at this. <laughs> this is so good. Wait, I even have a binky. <laughs> You're officially a mom. <laughs> so yeah, now that we know how to shop for jeans, I'm going to try to get some jeans. Yeah, I love the wide, wide legs that are in. Mm -hmm. I also have Western hats because I don't have any good hats. I know hats oh, have yeah. been in for so long and I just don't have any that I love right now. So mm -hmm. I don't know. I feel like they're kind of hard to thrift, but we can mm -hmm. keep our eyes out for them. Mm -hmm. I have neutral and tie-dye slats. So I just got some tie-dye sweat pants. I, you know, jumped on the bandwagon with yeah. that, but I want sort of just like a white or like maybe a light pastel like just plain sweatshirt mm -hmm. to go with them full of leather pants i have some like black ones and maybe like a color and maybe like a wider silhouette for those Cute. as well plaid pants also <laughs> nice i also put like patchwork and quilted jackets nice um nice. cottage core and victorian you Heck know yeah. i love a good cottage core then kind of random but um checkerboard print i feel like that's one mm -hmm. of those like nostalgic throwback like you know me in middle school kind of prints that i'm yeah. like i kind of I kind of want some checkerboard again. I kind of miss it. It's you know? so in right now, too. Yeah. yeah. Even just like the classic checkerboard bands. You know, I haven't mm -hmm. had those in so long. Like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. And then I also have a lot of um, green. Like, I have both lime green and sage green. Mm -hmm. So, like, sage is definitely more like a muted color that I yeah. probably already have in my wardrobe, but I really love it. And then lime green, I don't know. It's just, I don't do like super bright colors too much. So, mm -hmm. I think it'd be fun to like branch yeah. out a little bit. And then also crochet. Like, I, I don't know. I've started seeing nice. all these really like crazy, cool, like weird crochet things. Ooh, I love yeah. it. Yeah. So, anything like that, I'm really into. And then fringe also, like the really long fringe. Mm. So I have some things in my closet, but yeah, I feel like I just saw some really fun like runway pieces that were really fun and fringy. Cute. Yeah, so I have a lot of things too. So hopefully out of all of those, mm -hmm. you know, we'll um, come across some of these pieces. Awesome. <laughs> okay, so the store that we're going to go to is... The Salvation Army on Geary because yes. that's yeah. my favorite. Um, if you guys are interested in checking out my thrift guide to San Francisco, I have a video on that and then I also wrote a blog on it. You can actually look up on Google Maps my thrift guide to San Francisco. It's really cool and you can see all of the places that I've scored and all the scores on Google Maps and save it. So next time you're in san francisco you can just pull it up and really cool. head to the shops that i like to go to all right let's get, let's get going okay let's go This one too. Oh, beautiful. Oh, that was I like that one better because it yeah. doesn't have the um, shoulder pads. No shoulder pads. Oh, yeah. that's beautiful. That's really pretty. Oh my gosh, look at what oh, I just that's found. Beautiful. How cute. This is kind of like a little bit 
It's like a jumpsuit, but it's not. It's a oh. kind of mechanic. Yeah, yeah, interesting. Oh. Found some like, well, it's wax. It's not so leather, but I don't really like the uh, rise or the yeah. cut. In case you need to cinch your crew neck in even more. <laughs> Look what I just found. Oh, so cute. That'll be perfect for Monty. For Monty. Yeah, I mean, he's got to grow into it, but yeah, it'll be cute when he does. So sweet. I like I'm, those. I'm kind of looking for like high waist though, and it kind of looks a little bit too low. Oh, I see. I kind of want something a little bit more vintage. This pair's Target. They look pretty good though. Do you want to try them? Sure. Sometimes pleats are a little iffy, but might be hmm. When I went to private school for the couple years of high school, mm -hmm. the, they had these really awful pleated tackies, so I've never been oh. able to bring myself to wear pleated pants. <laughs> like, I would just freeze wearing a skirt rather than wear those pants that were so bad. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I also, I thought you might like this. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Look what I just found. Oh, that's so <gasps> good. I love that. How cute. That it's vintage, adorable. too. You can tell because the tag is yeah. it's tattered. Pretty excited about this little guy. That's, That's cute. Nice little print on it. Yes. A butterfly. It could kind of be construed as cottage core, maybe. <laughs> we just found out that we accidentally hit the biggest sale. <laughs> two dollars for all clothing. Every every clothing item, two dollars. Oh! Yeah. My jaws dropped. You can't tell. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, Kristen. Just start throwing things in the cart. <laughs> Just throw everything in the cart. I have a lot of things in sort of that like muted blue. I mean, although I do like it. It's you can reject dollars. it, Kristen. It's okay. Uh, we'll see what else I find. Well, let's put it okay. for now. It's kind of a sweater vest. I wonder if it would be a little bit too big, though. It what might, do you think? Yeah. I don't know if you want it a little bit more fitted. I kind of something a little bit tighter. Yeah, I could see that. Looking. But this is sage green, Kristen. It's true. It's it's almost olive yeah, though. Kind of olive yeah. Though. Never mind. <laughs> Just found this. <laughs> you, know, that, you know that's a sturdy sweater you when it breaks the hanger. Knit. Yeah. <laughs> so chunky. Chunky. Breaks the hanger. It's a vintage too. Cool. Um, and then, uh, how cool is this? Oh yeah, you're into the embroidery. Yeah, this is like embroidery. I don't know what it even says on it. That's pretty cool. I um, like it. Yeah, I like the I loops have, and everything. Yeah, I don't have anything this color. It has a little stain, but honestly, $2. Oh, I can't tell. Hard. Yeah, it looks great. It. Oh my gosh, look at this. What? Oh, that's so fun and retro. <gasps> I kind of like it. Orange. That's fun. Put it in the cart. Do Put it, it in the cart. <laughs> I think it looks kind of strengthened though, doesn't it? Like the way the wool is. Let's see. For sure. Yeah, it yeah. looks great. I like it. It's $2. $2. <laughs> What is this? It's kind of like a George Costanza type of coat, you know? I mean, could be a good thing. I do love George, but yeah, the color is interesting. Ooh, someone's tissues. Oh. Very sanitary. This is like total mom vibes, huh? I think I'm gonna go nay. <laughs> What'd you find? This little like Western shirt. <gasps> That's so cute. Really so this is interesting. This is like, um a really thin suede thing, kind of long. I'm gonna try it on. Okay, actually, it's not bad. Yeah, it's very soft. The only thing is it's got a massive hole on the back. Ooh, I like I that. Oh, yeah, kind of like <laughs> Yeah, that's cute. Your name. I like it, I like it. I think for $2, too big? It's really cool. It, it's cool in a way of like this. The um, trunk, kind of. Yeah. 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 Ooh, okay. So I want something like this, but not this specific one. <laughs> Here's one with like some bobbles on it, but it's an old navy. It's kind of not special enough for me. It's like a little puff sleeve orange. Oh, thing. interesting. It's a Taylor, but you know. So I like the color. I like the puff. I don't like this. I'm being like super oh, picky. Oh yeah. But I don't like this detail here. Yeah, I could see that. I mean, look at this. We yeah. gotta pare down some, you know, we gotta have some criteria. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Got a lot of stuff going yeah. here. I just found this like 100% silk, super bright green blouse. It's kind of cute. This is a cute shirt. Actually, I really like it. It's 
J. Crew. How funny. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Is that vintage? <gasps> oh my gosh, that's precious. If you don't get it, I will. You should get it because I have really? a vintage otter shirt. That one you that says do? I love otters on it, it's like blue. Oh, it's yeah, perfect. So we can Yay. <laughs> I'm so excited about this. So I feel like every time Kristen and I go thrifting, she always ends up finding me one thing that I'm like <gasps> obsessed with. So I found kind of an A-line dress, but it's black velvet and I just, I don't think I would wear it. And it has like a spot down at the bottom, but this is kind of what I'm looking for. I just found this kind of like A-line little dress would be cute with shirts and underneath and things with collars, but Looks a little bit too big for me, unfortunately. So I just found this little dress. It's kind of cute, but it's old navy. It's a medium size, and I don't know. I just feel like it's too, I don't know, too basic, I guess. Oh my gosh, that's color, so girl. precious. Yeah. I love it. It's a little faded, but... It's very cottage core. Yeah, it is cottage core. Oh my gosh, it's perfect. It's kind of a cute plaid. New York & Co. I just found this cool long sleeve shirt. All that in dim sum. Okay, here it is. I actually think it's really cool. I don't really have any like relaxed long sleeve shirts like this. It's kind of neat. Yeah, and little uh, yin yangs on it are cool. There's one on the, on the arm too. Oh, does Jason need an ice cream pie? <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Like my middle school self would have totally like worn this as a belt or like with a t-shirt or something. Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay, now we need to pare down yeah. <laughs> and decide what we're gonna get. I like it. I think it's really a stunning color. It's really cool. Yeah, it's so yeah. unique. And also, I was thinking about it, I don't really have any flannels. I have literally one flannel left. Oh, that I on to. that's and, awesome. Uh, yeah, you need so flannel. I feel like for camping or something like that, or just kind of like lounging around. Yeah, it's a great like San Francisco weather, like pretty much any time yeah. of year. This is a yes. I don't even have to try it on. Oh, I need to try this on. This green one. I didn't show you this, Kristen. Oh, yeah, that's it's kind of crazy. <laughs> Ooh, I'm into it. I like that. It's so Is fun. It too 80s? It's a little 80s, but it's in a like a. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of 80s. Yeah, a lot of. I mean, I could, I could try it. It's only $2. I don't know. I don't know if I. I, mean, I think it's cute. How would you fun. style it? Like black jeans, you know, just keep it pretty simple. Yeah, you can even pair it with like um, a long midi skirt. Oh, that would be fun. Yeah, yeah. I could do that. Do you need a sweater for winter? I have so many sweaters. I feel like it's dry. Yeah. I like how the wool is really like tight. Maybe pass then. Yeah. So here's that orange polka dot shirt. I think I kind of like it because the polka dots are massive, so it makes it kind of mod looking, like like sixties ish. Kind of a nice winter sweater. Ah. You're torn between the two. Yeah, they're so similar, but. I don't know, they're just like Which one looks cooler different. to you? I feel like this one looks cooler just because of like the I think it would fit. fit better. Yeah. I think it would fit better. I think so. Because I like this color better, but I think it will look kind of frumpy on. It's a bigger size and mm -hmm. it might be weird once they took the shoulder pads out. I don't know. Yeah. This one's probably Good a call. Safer bet. Yeah. This is such a pretty little blouse. It's very delicate. Kind of bulky. Like, I don't know if I really yeah. So oh my gosh, it's so cute. Just keep buttoning it. Yeah. It's so cute. You really think it's like bulky? It. A little bit. I get so picky with, with the way things fit and then I just won't wear it. You're so. passing. If, if you love it, you should just do I it. I mean, I'm going to get yeah, it. You should get it. I also have some little sweaters kind of like this. So. Okay. So we paired it down and I did find some paw pants. Didn't try them on, but hopefully they'll work. They have elastic waist. Yeah, they have elastic waistbands. So it's a little confident. forgiving. Yeah. I got this kind of sage-ish olive green silk mm -hmm. blouse. Um, you Go together maybe. Mm -hmm. I got this really fine western top mm -hmm. just because, I mean, it's so cute and fun. Yes. And then this little um, vintage blouse. And the thing that really sold me, I don't know if you can see it, there's like these like weird mushrooms and like butterflies. There's, oh, like, the mushies. Dragonflies somewhere in there. No, little like bees. So cute. I don't know, it's just such a unique print. I just felt like I needed it. So. Yeah. Yeah. 
Nice. Yeah, that's it? That's it. Grand total of $8. Yes. <laughs> okay, so I'm getting basically the whole store. But it's only $2 each, so. <laughs> okay, so start out with this blouse. So pretty. This guy. I like that it's a more eccentric take on a polka dot. I'm doing this, just like a fun graphic tee to go underneath stuff. Cute. This guy. Oh, so good. Very I love that. Cute. This one, I think this might be like my favorite thing I found today. Got embroidery on it. I'm getting this little Yes, glass. I'm so glad you're doing that one. It's Sweater. so cute. Just and passed it up. Just didn't fit, but it's adorable. This is for Monty when he gets bigger, so he can always remember where he was born. Aww. Um, this little guy, which I'm gonna experiment with, I might end up selling it in one of my closet sales, but it's cute. This is a sweater Kristen found Yay, for me. Yeah, I'm so glad you liked it. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm kind of like experimenting with this yellow color because I don't really have anything this color in my wardrobe. It's like a pastel yellow, but I thought I'd try it for the spring. This fun little Chinese restaurant t-shirt. I think it's really fun. It kind of reminds me of something that Urban Outfitters might have. You know, <laughs> I could see that. Style yeah. Type of thing. I love this little yes! so fresh. <laughs> this one is like a little out there for me, but I try to make some style it up cool. I think, yeah, I think it'll work. Um, This sweater for winter. So cozy. And last but not least, this cool flannel. Just, I really like the colors in it. Yeah, it's really yeah. fun. And that's it, $28. Not bad. All of that for $28. That's wild. That's insane. Wow. Okay. I'm so excited. What do you think of this? Oh, I cute? love that. That's so cool. I like how it's gathered at the top yeah, and the like straw. Like so cute and springy too. I know. Yeah. That's really cute. I like it. I think you should get it. Yeah. Okay, we are back. It's pretty successful. I think it was really good, yeah. Yeah. So you only spent $8. Yes. I spent 33 with But you got so much good purse. stuff. I know I yeah. did. That little purse that I added on at the end was so cute. I feel like it was like a little granny bag. I love it. Like you could tell that some granny had it and took really good care of it. But I was telling Kristen, it's so funny because every time we go thrifting, she is so conservative with what she ends up taking home. She takes home like one or two pieces. Four was a lot for you today. It was a lot, yeah. I have a very small closet space, so yeah. I have to be strategic, but I think yeah. these are all great and I will find a place for them. Yeah. Yeah. I think you got some good stuff. I what agree. was your favorite thing you got? I think, well, depending on how they look, probably the plaid pants. The plaid pants. pants yeah, because that's what I was kind of had in mind to get. So, yeah. yeah. Nice. So, yeah, you found uh, from your Pinterest, you found plaid pants. Yep, and sage green. Sage I mean, it's green. kind of all of me, but it's, I'd say it's sage. sage. Yeah. Uh, yeah, this isn't really. I don't, I mean, cottage core. Kind of cottage core because of like the weird like mushrooms and Mushroom stuff. Mushroom floral print. Yeah, I count? think so. <laughs> Loosely. It's yeah. like, like cottage core in the 1970s or yeah. something. Yeah. <laughs> what did you find from your Pinterest? I found, oh, the green blouse. Yep. Um, I found that orange and white polka dot. Oh, yeah, orange. So it's like kind mm -hmm. of orange. Um, and then, oh, the embroidered coat thing. Oh, that, that was so, so cute. Yeah. Um, so embroidery, I never find embroidered stuff at thrift stores. So I was like really surprised. It's a good that. find. Yeah. 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 You found a plaid shirt. I mean, it's not pants, but it's oh, still yeah. really good plaid and plaid. it's green. Yeah. It's green too. Huh? Yeah, okay. Totally. I found some good stuff. I, I agree, mean, it yeah. wasn't like everything on my Pinterest board, but I feel like that's kind of just the way it goes, you know? It's thrifting. So, yeah. yeah. We, we covered some of the bases and yeah. there's always next time. So. Yeah. <laughs> that was an amazing sale though. Agreed. $2 per item. That's oh the gosh. best sale I've ever been to at a Salvation. I, yeah, I haven't been to anything like that before. It's so good. So good, yeah. yeah. Stay tuned to the end because I'm going to try everything on for you guys. So if you guys have liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and please subscribe. You're beautiful, beautiful just, just the, the way, way you are. are. Also, I wanted to say really quick, um, if you guys want to follow my Pinterest, I will link it down in the description box for you. So make sure to check it out down there. And until next time, see you later. Bye.
Sorry, it's reflecting on my face. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Your phone. Oh, just in case you're wondering, this is where you want to look. Oh, got it. Okay. The camera's right there. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Does he have to be bouncing a basketball outside right now? <laughs> 